Hey everyone, I have yet another great looking, very clean vehicle to add to our pre-owned inventory here at Legends Toyota of Kansas City. This is a 2013 Acura ILX. It is a four cylinder front wheel drive vehicle. Like I said, this car is very clean inside and out, has a backup camera, uh, has what is called the convenience package. So you're gonna have a backup camera, mud guards on here, silver with black leather interior, heated seats, paddle shifters, Bluetooth compatibility. It definitely has a few options on it. Another great thing is that it has brand new tires all the way around on here. Now, uh, they are a little bit dirty, a little salt on the roads, but like I said, brand new tires on here. And I'm also gonna give you a better shot at the 17 inch alloy wheels. Now we're heading into the back of the vehicle. You do have your factory carpet and floor mats and an all-weather cargo mat, which I think is a great little combination there. And you also have your all-weather floor mats, so you kind of get the best of both worlds. You do have a bench back seat, so uh, with the pull of this little lever here in the upper left-hand corner, it will disengage that seat and you can lay it completely flat, which will really increase that cargo space. And also, there's a little sub right back there to help increase that sound quality. It's just behind the, uh, in between the two headrests. Alrighty, now we're gonna head into the back of the car. I always like to start with the rear passenger door panel. I state in 100% of these videos that typically online you never see photos of door panels, so I always like to give a uh, quick shot of them. Unfortunately, sometimes they will have some scratches and stuff there, so I always like to avoid any type of negative surprise. Positive ones are always welcome though. Backs of the seats have not been kick scuffed up or damaged. Carpet looks great in here. No stains, looks like those floor mats were always used. Has that black perforated leather. No foul odors in the vehicle. It's a non-smoker unit, so you don't have to worry about any burn holes or anything like that. It does have that sunroof up there, as you can see. Kind of looks like you have a lot going on, but it's very simple up here. Um, almost like a, a cockpit-style front. But you're going to have a single to CD player, AM, FM radio, Bluetooth compatibility so you can connect your phone, stream your phone calls, music, and audio through the car, and satellite radio. You got that little red button. Typically, you never want to push that in a car, but that will start this car. Um, push button start as long as the key is anywhere inside the car. Simply apply your foot to the brake, push the button, I'll start right up for you. You do have an auto dimming rear view mirror up here, and then just above that, you'll have home link where you can pre program your uh, garage door openers. High low heated seats on both driver and passenger side leather wrapped steering wheel with paddle shifters and pretty much all of your controls you're going to need for the entire car in there everything but putting it in drive power locks and power windows in here along with a power driver seat and of course power adjustable side mirrors Alrighty, last but not least we're going to hit the driver's area of the vehicle this of course is the most high traffic area it is typically where you will see the most standard wear and tear if any as i have mentioned numerous times before this car is in mint condition inside and out our reconditioning crew does a very good job on the details as well so they always try to get it next to uh, like new condition as possible you have that power adjustable driver seat as far as the edge of the seat goes has a lot of that factory shape hasn't flattened out at all and not a single crack in there so that's always a plus bucket seats really hug you definitely gives the uh, car a sporty feel As you can tell, it is a great little car with a lot of options on it. Come check it out today at Legends Toyota of Kansas City off of I-435 and Parallel Parkway.